Africa belongs to God. India and Pakistan belong to us. <laughs> what? The topic is changing. The topic is changing. Pakistan belongs to God. No, no. English, English. <laughs> How did Judas die? How did Jesus die? Yes. What happened? How did Jesus die? Where Roman King Jesus? He was crucified. No, no, no. How did he die? Why Roman King Jesus? He was crucified. He crucified Jesus. Why did he say that? He was crucified. Judas. Judas, Judas. Oh, Judas. How did he die? Oh, he hung himself. Judas hung himself. I have another verse telling me something else. What? I keep on the picture. Judas hung himself. There's another bus. There's someone. Says here, now this man purchased the field with the reward of iniquity and falling headlong. And he burst asunder in the midst and all his bowels gushed out. He doesn't say where he hanged himself. Yeah. There's a contradiction. Read that scripture, yes. And then the other verse says he purchased, he cast down the pieces of silver, he threw away the silver. So these two verses, they go against each other. Acts 118 and Matthew 27 5. Yeah, there's a clear contradiction. contradiction. In the That's a contradiction. Those two are contradicted. Yes. Anyway, can't... I'm not going to come off my topic to go on that, really. No, but, this is very but, important. But you can, you can go ahead discussing what you are discussing. This is very important. What he said, can't tell you, your Bible you're holding now is contradictory. It's not reliable. And the word of God should so contain contradictions. This can never be the word of God. Yeah. The word of God is perfect. Yeah. So where the word of God is? Who? Where the word of God is? The word of we God. This is, is the word of God. No, this, the word of God is here, I'll show you. This is the word of God. No, no, he just told you contradiction. contradiction. So many contradictions. Also, uh, did, uh, did uh, Jesus carry his cross? When he was going to die. The only contradiction yeah, So many, I can show you. Jesus did he carry his own cross? The Bible said, yes, he carried his own cross. Uh, that's in John, Gospel of John, chapter number seven, uh, uh, chapter number, what was it? Two contradictions. John, verse number, verse number 17. Sorry? Let me bring it. Yeah. Two, two, two contradictions. You have to get in the, into the contradiction. You have to get into the scripture properly. Uh, John, uh, uh, John 1917. John 1917 says that yeah, Jesus carried yeah, 1717 that Jesus carried his own cross. But then you got Matthew uh, 27 32 said Simon, a man named Simon, carried the cross. So which one is it? Did Jesus carry his cross? Look at the two. John 19, yeah, John, uh, 1917, verses Matthew uh, 27, Look at the two and see. Let me save this. Amazing contradiction, those two. Yeah? What's the other one? The other one is uh, Matthew yeah. 27, 32. You can open your Bible. Yeah. The one said that as you, okay. Matthew uh, 27, okay. verse number 32. So if you look at the two, if you look at the two, the first one, John, um, 1970, he said, they took Jesus and he went out, bearing his own cross, to the place called the place of skull, which is called in Hebrew Golgotha. So according to John, yeah, but when you go to, when you go to uh, Matthew 27, 32 says, that as they were marching out, they came across a man of Sarene, Simon by name. This man, they compared to carry his cross. So which one is it? Is it according to John? Who carried the cross? According to John or according to uh, Matthew? Contradiction is there. John said Jesus carried his own cross. Matthew said Simon. This is the example of contradiction. Let me see. No, 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 no. The contradiction is that you can read it now and see that the Bible is contradicted. You're just looking for something. No, 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 no. No, no, no. The most important thing is 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 the most important thing is
the word of God. I'm not with you with that. No, the word of God should not contain contradiction. The word of God is written here. But that word is contradiction. But the why is that contradiction? Why is it contradiction? Why is it contradiction? Can we read it together? What's the contradiction? Can you read it together? Yes. Open the verse. What was the Matthew? Yeah. Okay, if you read it, about Jesus, if you read it, I will listen. If you read it, I will listen to you. Read, okay. read, read what? Read that. Uh, you, read, you read that, uh, John. No, you read what you read. Okay, you got John. Okay, John. You open your Bible. John, okay. No, you got, which one you read? John, I will listen to you. John 1917. I'll read Matthew. I'll read Matthew. I'll go to Matthew. I'll read John 1917. I'll read Matthew and you see the contradiction so that you know. I'll read it, yeah. Matthew. Are you listening now? Yo, Matthew 27, Matthew 32, Matthew 27, Ma uh, Matthew 27 yeah, 25, 26, 27, 32, hold on. Do you want to read first? Yeah, 27, 32, let me read uh, 32, yeah, hold on, 32, yeah, 32, yeah, is it? Yeah, Matthew, let me read, no, read yours first, okay. sorry. John, John 19, 17, and he bearing his cross went forth into a place called the place of a skull, and he bearing his cross, which is called in the Hebrew called God. God, I see. So now, Jesus. if you go to Matthew, now, it's going to read, Matthew, now, Matthew uh, 27, 32 said, as they were going out, they met a man from Cyrene named Simon, and they forced him to carry the cross. So which one is it? Is it according to uh, John? John 1917. That's an contradiction. Yeah, what is contradiction? Yeah, that's, is that no contradiction? One said Jesus carried his cross. What do you mean? Okay, explain why it's not contradiction. One said, John said Jesus carried his own cross. He, to was, he was carrying it. Yeah, but Matthew said... And then someone else... Put it on someone else. No, no, they did not say that. No, he never, he never said that. Yeah. No, he said as they were coming. Simon was carrying. It was Jesus was carrying. That is, a, is your topic, you know. That is your. This topic. is a very important. No, no, that's the Bible said. Was preaching. No, I said that's what the Bible said. I said the Bible they are carrying. But you are preaching. said a lot of things. But the Bible you are carrying is for contradictions now. And the word of God should not contradict. You are reading from the Bible. So it's contradiction for you. It's not contradiction for so me. What does contradiction mean? Okay, okay, that's it. That is a word have not. Uh, but two statements go one against each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two you agree, right? Mm. Do these two uh, statements go against each other? That's what you are saying. Do you agree with me right now? No, I'm not agreeing. So what does it mean? Also, also the Bible said, uh, 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 what, was the, what, what was the last word of Jesus? According to uh, uh, Luke, according to Luke, Gospel of Luke, chapter number 23, verse number 46 says that, so you only carry that Father, you only Father, carry that book, look, no, no, Luke, Luke, uh, Luke 23, Luke 23, 46. Say, Father, into, the, into thy hands I commit my spirit. According to thy you. hands I commend my spirit. Yeah, to commit, yeah. yes. But when you go, but when you go to uh, John, John, John 19:30 says, it is finished. John 19. John 19:30 say, it is finished. According to John, the last word, 19:30:30. That's it is finished. That's it, yeah. So which one is it? Is it into, into uh, Father into thy hands to commit my spirit, or is it finished? Which one is it? Well, uh, all yes, I say is a change word in different books. Uh, it's what? In your Bible. A change word in different Bible. You, no, is it, if you read the same, it's the same thing. In the same Bible there, and also it said, the Bible said that, you know, like the word of, uh, the, it said, uh, was the word of, uh, was the, the, the commandment in the Old Testament, is it useful? The Bible says yes and no. They, they, rewrite, they rewrite this Bible. They write them over. Yes, they and, and, and they change them. They change the words. Oh, thank you very much. So they change the Bible. Thank you. That's they change the words. They change, they change, change the Bible. Bible. Yeah. Some of the Bible. So they change the Bible. They change some of the book. So they change, they change what's in there. So that means they change. They change the words. So the Bible has been changed. Some of those Bibles. So the Bible has been changed. Been changed. I, I stick with this one. I stick with this one. So can I, can I say contradiction in that one? This one, you read two statements are uh, contradictory. The one you have got at the moment. I can show you contradiction there. Can I show you? This one is, you can't go around, you cannot 
this is emphatic, uh, clear contradiction. Uh, the question is, so what was the... When you say no, contradiction. So you don't believe in what in, the, in this book. No, you don't listen to me. You, no, no, let me tell you. You are saying contradiction. Yes. You don't believe in what in this book. I don't believe that the Bible you got here is 100% word of God. It's contradictory. It contains the word of God. For example, when God said, Hosea 11, 9, it for I am God it, and not man. I believe in that. It can't God is not a man. It, it can't take it the word of hey, God. Hey, that's why I cannot hear. But right, God like, is a spirit. Uh, unlike, no, God is, but God is a spirit. Yes. But what the Bible said? The word of God, what cannot be what? What he said? The Bible said, the grass withered, the flower feathered, the flower feathered, but the word of God shall stand forever. The Bible said that. And the Bible said, God is not an author of confusion. It is not. First, you, first when, Corinthians 14, 30. When you appear before Jesus Christ, you're going to argue with him? Argue what? When you appear before Jesus Christ, you're going to argue with him no. and tell him that he's contradicting. No, no. What? This that you have contradiction in your book? In the, in no, book? that's not Jesus' book. But this is not Jesus' book. No, Je where, where is Jesus' the, book? The New, the New Testament. Where, where is Jesus' book? You know the New Testament? Where was the, the, the New Testament? The New Testament was written in the day of Jesus. In the, the, the Old Testament? The, no, in the time of Jesus. The Old Testament is, is prophecy. No, the Old Testament, listen to me. When the New Testament was written, was Jesus around? What was he written? He wasn't written at the time of Jesus. Jesus did not have Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John with him. No. This is what he, these are the words of eyewitnesses. Those were his yeah, yeah. disciples. Sorry. Those were his, those people were his disciples. Which people? Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Was, Why did he get a uncle? Come on, uncle. Was uncle, can you believe it? Wait, I've never heard. It. Yeah. Never heard I can't. Look, look, look. Listen to me. Where did he get that from? Where, no, no. Where? Okay. Who was who was Luke? Tell me, Luke. Who? He doesn't even know who Luke. Let's go to Luke. Look now. Let's go to Luke. Who is Luke? Read your Bible. Read your Bible. Like European names. Who is that? Who is Luke then? No, I'm going to look. Tell me Luke then. You must explain. How can Luke be? You must explain to Je people Jesus, why you know. Jesus has 12 disciples. Yeah? The, you know the, the gospel of four of them? Why are not the city? Why are not one of them? Well, Luke was a late disciple. So I'm saying so. I don't know what you're talking about. So the, the Bible you oh, hold at the moment, that Jesus will come and say, This Bible 100% is the word of God. Jesus, look, look when, when you believe in Trinity, the concept of Trinity, first epistle of John 5 7, for there are three that bear record in heaven, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost, and these three are one. Would Jesus say, Oh, yeah, yeah? Look what I was preaching. Would Jesus believe in that? Look what I was preaching. Sorry, yeah, yeah. Mm. You want to see what I was preaching? Yeah. I preach from here. There is one body, mm. one spirit, mm. even as you are called in one hope of your call. Yeah. One Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God, yeah. and Father of all, yeah. who is above all, yeah. and to you all, mm. in you all. The Father. The Father. You said the Father there? That's, yeah. well, that's what the Father. Yeah, if he said the Father. The Father. So why, why do you say Jesus is God? And Jesus, you, is the the Jesus? Jesus is the Father. Jesus is the Father. Jesus is the Father. Jesus is the Father. Uncle, come on, uncle. 